So we're here today at the Molly and Jack Zicklin residence of MJHS Hospice and we are celebrating our second wedding ever here of Malcolm and Sonia and it is a real honor and privilege for us to be sharing in such a joyful moment. We met Malcolm uh, last November and uh, Sonia has been here with him and they met about six years ago and for the last couple of years Malcolm has been asking Sonia to marry him. And finally, a few weeks ago, they, she finally agreed to marry him. Um, he is um, declining and quite ill, and that was part of the reason that we um, decided to have the wedding at the time we're having it now. Right, so Take Malcolm. Take Malcolm. To be my husband. To be my husband. From this day forth. From this day forth. In accordance with God's holy word. In accordance with God's holy word. I, Malcolm. I, Malcolm. Take Sonia. Take to be my wife, to be my wife, from this day forth. I told him that he would have to fix his teeth before I could marry him. And um, so he he made an appointment. He was going to do to do it, and then he had a seizure, and he went into the hospital, and they found out that he had lesions on the brain, which was cancerous, and he had one in his lung, which was also cancerous. So it metastasized from the lung to the brain. So he had a difficult cancer to treat. This is an IV way. I think that this just <coughs> makes us closer in the eyes of God, you know, so that we have a bond that no man can break. I now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss the bride. I love him. That's, that's why I want to do this thing for him because he had asked me to marry him long before he got sick.